my front yard has a whole lot of ugly. So we're tackling a new part of the yard that I haven't really shown you, or I have shown you a little bit. Remember when I showed you the weeds? Well, we removed all the weeds. We've been digging it up. But wow, digging it up has turned out to be a lot more challenging than we ever realized. This gopher netting has been put in and this ground is hard as a rock. So we're chipping away at the soil to get down to the gopher netting and then pulling out the gopher netting and then chipping away at this very, very hard soil. One of the problems that we are running into is that the gopher netting isn't all in one place. You find it, you remove it, and then all of a sudden you find another layer of it. And then sometimes it's just wrapped around a plant and wrapped under a pipe but over a pipe. It is very, very challenging, and we had no idea that we were going to be working this hard. But we figure if a thing is worth doing, it's worth doing right. And we want to set it up the right way one time, so we don't ever have to do it again. We were super pleased to discover a working irrigation system already set up. We knew we planned on putting in no larger than a one gallon plant. So we bought one solitary one gallon plant so that we could use it to check for depth. And then we met our nemesis, the scraggly old stump from the palm tree that we had removed. Well, this nightmare of roots that we have worked on for three days trying to get out, I am now going to attack with a sawzall. I have not held a sawzall for quite some time. This should be interesting. So here we go. Let's give this a shot. saw. We used an axe. We used shovels. Literally what it took was just sitting there and gradually pulling all the roots out of the gopher netting. Ultimately worth it, but a pain. All the gopher netting out of here, and then we got all of the gopher netting out of here, and we are going to dig it out a little bit further and then put in fresh gopher netting. Well, we're on day five of batter, and today I am so excited. We are heading to the nursery. So, yeah, 
yes, this is the exciting part. We are going to the nursery and getting all of the plants today for our front yard. And uh, then we're going to put it in. Well, probably we have hours more work still to do before we're ready to put plants in, but yay. So this is a big adventure. We're actually going to a nursery that's about an hour away because they have really, really an amazing selection. So come on, let's go to Rogers Gardens. some soil and some soil amendment in and then we're gonna be getting these plants in the ground. I love you bunches. I hope you have an awesome rest of your day and I will talk to you very soon. Mm -hmm. 